We flew over mountains and crossed ravines. We outsmarted earthquakes and landed on asteroids. And this year, we delivered supplies uphill after a big drop. No batteries allowed. We are the thousands of young engineers who completed the tech challenge presented by Dell. We made many different prototypes. It took us a lot of brainstorming, and we think we did really well in this competition. It's a really good opportunity to learn something new in engineering, but in a fun way. The Tech Challenge is a program by the Tech Museum of Innovation designed for kids like me. Every year, teams of students in grades 4 through 12 solve a problem inspired by challenges real engineers face. We work together for months designing and building a device, testing and rebuilding it, again and again and again. We document our design process in journals and show our work to judges. And we see if our solution works at a final showcase. So this year's challenge is Drop and Dash, and students are building devices that can survive a 10-foot drop and deliver their one penny payload up a ramp, and they have to do it with no batteries allowed. We support the Tech Challenge because tomorrow's problems are going to be solved by scientists and by engineers, and we need as many of those as we possibly can get. Your ideas are powerful. They will always be powerful. And one day, your ideas can change the world. Even if something fails, there's still a better way to do it, and you can continue with that idea and keep going with it. I'm just so inspired to see what the tech does, to really let kids know what's possible, right? To introduce them to engineering concepts and just the whole notion of endless possibilities. They're learning about science and engineering and the scientific method, and they're working through adversity. That's how real problems get solved in the world. We learn new skills like creativity, teamwork, risk-taking, and problem-solving. We learn quickly from failure. We become innovators. And they're realizing that actually when we work together as a team, we can come up with a better answer than when we work alone. The kids are so creative. They are excited. They are smart. They are fun. I love that it was more than just making things. It was bringing people together. I wasn't really interested in engineering before, but this has got me interested. Better decisions are made by groups that are diverse and inclusive. It's demonstrated today by the level of uh, creativity and results. Everyone takes a different approach and you see the youngest kids are not bound by physics and the oldest kids are trying to stay inside boundaries that they've learned. The tech challenge is building future engineers, future leaders, people that we want and need to innovate for the future. The tech challenge taught me a lot about myself what I work strong in and how I can do what I want to do if I'm passionate about it. We, we love the Tech Challenge! The Tech Challenge, bringing Silicon Valley together to inspire the next generation of engineers and innovators for 31 years. Hey, that's older than me!